that's kind of a cool sound. So I'm going to keep that sound right there, and I'm going to grab the same MIDI information that we used for our vacuum synth. I'm going to hold Option, and I'm going to drag that down. So let's start building up an arrangement here. Um, and let's go ahead and listen to just this sound. I'm going to solo it for a second. Now you'll notice, I want to go in. I'm going to hit uh, Apple A to select them all. And then I'm going to go through and extend these out a little bit. Try, uh, I'm going to add in our bass sound. Actually, I'm going to do something a little bit different. Kind of like that more of a hint of that arpeggiator, which is kind of a cool sound. Actually, on this bass sound that I was using earlier, I think what might be kind of cool is to go into this sequence, and let's extend these out. So I'm going to grab this, and we'll make these last as long as the notes are. Should, probably won't sound much different than what I've already programmed. I'm just going to extend these out, and I'll show you why in just one second. Let's go back and look at that instrument. And I want to point out that there's a little arpeggiator down here at the bottom. So what I can do is turn that arpeggiator on, I'm going to slow it down to an eighth note. I'm going to go back into this, select all my notes, and I'm going to transpose this. I'm actually going to copy the same notes just going to raise it up one octave. And we'll try the same thing but going down an octave. So there's one other instrument we haven't checked out yet, and that was Boom. Boom is a drum module, a really fun drum module, sort of saving the best for last. In here you'll find all manner of different types, styles of drum kits, urban, dance, electro, 909, 808, retro. Put it on urban and I'll hit play. All I'm doing right now is using the keys on my keyboard to switch between different patterns. If I want this to play in half time, I can go down to where it says speed. Check out a different drum kit. 